Hello everyone and welcome back to Satisfactory. I'm your host Eli Teague, joined by Exodiac. Hello. So what do you think of my power fuel assembly line I've got going here? Yeah, I saw it. I like it. I like Looking it a lot. It. I like it a lot. It's not the most efficient, but it's good enough. Because the important thing is just to keep pumping out fuel. And the reason we have such a backlog of this is I had a bunch on me earlier. But I think I might actually need to split it off into another constructor for solid, funnily enough. Just Probably, yeah. Because it's actually built up on what I had before. So I had a bunch before, but not that much. So we're probably going to make it a little bit more efficient. Uh, in order to do that, I actually, uh, goodbye. Uh, goodbye inventory space. Okay. Okay. And then splitter. Uh, come on. Work with me here. I need input and then two outputs. Why, why is this? This thing sucks. <laughs> what the heck? I need it to output on the other side. There we go. Was that so hard to ask, game? Like you have no idea. Right. Oh my gosh, really? working. Oh yeah, conveyor belt mark one. I just realized that. Yes. Eventually we'll get better ones. That makes sense. I just did it though. Fine. Ignore, ignore this. You didn't see it. It's down here. No idea. I don't know where you Power slug. This semi slug seems to emit unfamiliar energy readings, which could potentially be retrofitted into fix it technology. A new research tree can now be accessed Ooh, in the MAM. That means infinite power by the sounds of it. Uh, it increases the abilities of things. Oh, sad. So we can make power out of it. Like strap it in a glass bowl and just provide power. Yeah, it's just overclocking pretty much. That's disappointing. Alright, I need to actually power to this. It used to be green and yellow and now it's blue and yellow. Interesting. Alright. We now have double solid fuel outputs. Maybe. Yeah, there she goes. Uh, can't make it. Dang. Wow. I mean, bits of lag here and there, but overall, we're doing okay. I mean, it's something to be expected from an early access game, to be fair. Okay. Nope, no, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, 
apparently have a ton more wood on me than I just realized. Oh, wait, no, that's ball biofuel. What is it? I think I saw the biofuel and thought it was wood. I'm smart. Uh, to be fair, they do kind of look like wood logs. They do look very similar. I'm about to make you something amazing. Yay. I like things. You're making me something amazing while I'm making your power more efficient and better. Uh, oh, no. Yeah. Okay. So we have a maximum capacity of 190 and max consumption is 138. So we're good. That's it. Oh, yeah, zip nine. Nice. You ready to see what it does? I assume it makes a zip line and then pulls us up or something. We use the power poles. No way. Yep. That's cool. How, how do you... You just hold left click and yeah. jump. Oh, okay, so I have to jump on the power line. I see. Ah. You have to be able to reach it. Yeah, that makes sense. Hello, friends. Nope, game. Why game? This is going to take some getting used to, but I like it. I, I think it would be better if it allowed us to make our own zip lines, personally. Maybe it's just me, but... Well, technically you can, it's just that they also double up as power lines. And this is true. But like I was thinking of, you shoot it out, and then you zip line on it. Kind of like a real life zip line gun. Well, I don't know if it's real life, but like a movie zip line gun. So that wood to biofuel uh, constructor is paper efficient in that the wood biofuel uh, thing is super crazy. It's four wood to 20 biofuel. Granted, we don't have a lot of wood. We have so many leaves, but still. <clears throat> oh, I got absolutely wrecked. What'd you do? I made a, a zip line all the way down uh -oh. uh, to the, like, down there. And I uh, may or may not have um, accidentally aggroed a fire spitter, and nice. he just rocked my world. Frick! Frick! Game! Game is bad. You died? Yeah. First death? Yeah. I had not died before that moment. And I'm only back up to 3 HP, what the heck? Are, you just, are we just permanently at 3 HP now? You can heal up, mm -hmm. but um, it takes some time. Okay, well, that's or dumb. It can anyway. Yeah, I went to get on the zip line, right? Uh, I hit the power pole and it just dropped me, and I fell to my death. And I can't respawn now. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, it's all the way down there. Ow. Take, take, take off. Oh, mine. Mine. They call it a mine. Okay. Um. Ow. Aha. Uh, game, game, I'm stuck on this. Game, <laughs> what the heck, man? This is so dumb. Is it because this is technically down and I can't zip line uphill? Yeah. Oh. Well, kind of. You're stuck on the pole, is what's going on. Uh, fair enough. Let's try this again. That was Oh, 
Okay, yeah. I was just stuck on the pole, I see. And then I just missed the... Uh, this, this is so jank. I, well, the thing is, I, I get stuck on the pole because I can't actually get onto the wire. It's not letting me. How dare. How dare you show off you your just, skills. You, you just be good. Get good. There we go. Like Dark Souls. Now you just have to jump at the right angle. Yeah, it's so wonky. But hey, at least we have a way back up now. <laughs> Ooh, for shot at. <laughs> I was getting shot at, and then I almost fell to my death again because of the exact same bullcrap. Nice. Yeah, it's quiet. Yeah. It's fun, but definitely crazy. Heck yeah, look at that biofuel. As long as we can supply it with wood and leaves, we will have infinite fuel. Okay, our other two uh, main power generators by the base just shut off the one from the hub. But we still have a max of 150, so I think we're pretty okay overall. It's consuming 75.5 and our max is 138, so I think we're okay. Ah, it looks like crap solid biofuel. <laughs> it literally looks like giant crap. <laughs> That's funny. What's all this down? Ooh. Fancy. You can play tic-tac-toe on this. <laughs> this is true. I'm sure some okay. people have. It's funny. This is This is a fun thing. Is it like a paint gun or something? A piece of equipment? It's X. X. I, uh, hmm. And then it's a custom swatch. Um, customize your menu. Right mouse button. Edit. Is paint. And baby poop green. I don't uh, know. If you if you want the specific colors I have, it is hashtag one e o o a a for the first one. One e o o or zero zero. Zero zero a a. Okay, for the first one. And then the second one is seven b a b five two. Sorry, I said preset. It's seven b a five two. B five two. 7BAB52? Yes. Okay. Baby poop. Alright. Select. There we go. Yay. Ow. This one says it's applied, but it doesn't look like it. Hmm. This one's just a bit wonky, I think. It's fine. The combiner works differently. Okay. Interesting. Well, I, I see. It's builder and customizer. Okay. That's cool. So is this going to be your main factory floor or something? Something like that. 
just going to be a 10 by 10 square. I mean, fair enough. Space elevator is going to be on top of it. Oh, that makes sense, yeah. Wow, you can color things fairly far away. Mm hmm. <laughs> Which is nice. We haven't done anything over at the copper mine. No. In a while. There's not much to do over there anyway. I mean, so. yeah, it's just it's just a copper, really. All of these copper. Oh, we've got so many iron plates. This is good. Iron plates are important. Especially for building a space elevator. You have a, lot of, you have a decent amount of cables. You know, almost three stacks. I'd say that's decent. About two builds. Oh, that's the miner. I just suddenly started hearing this rumbling as I was walking. I was like, what the frick is that? That was just the miner. Assembler. Oh, the assembler is how you make the screws and plates into enhanced plates or whatever they're called. Mm-hmm. Oh, are we finally getting sunset? Or something? Oh, there is a day night cycle in this game. I forgot about that. I haven't noticed it at all. Maybe it's just me, but. It's a long day night cycle. <laughs> yeah. That much I can tell. So we've been playing this for almost four hours now, and that's a pretty long day night cycle, if I do say so myself. Yep. Unless it's already gone by once and I just wasn't paying attention, which I wouldn't be surprised. Let's look at the space elevator. Awesome sick. Awesome sure. I think the awesome shop would be even more awesome is if you didn't have to unlock everything every playthrough. I don't know. I don't even know if that's I don't know if you do kind of mess with it, but still. I'm just saying. Oh, we need... Actually, we have enough cables. I think we can build a space elevator. It doesn't need cables, it needs wires and... Uh, sorry, wires, yeah. We are just barely short. I actually have 300 on me, in fact. Oh, well, I have 1,450 on me. Well then, maybe we should combine our power. And expand our infrastructure. I right. have everything. I have everything else except for concrete. I'm, I still am not able to get over how huge those copper wires are. How much concrete do you have? Uh, that's a good question. I have seventy-seven. I need half of that. Right-click, and it will split it in half. So thirty-nine. Yep. There you go. Thank you. Yep. Ah, holy crap, it's huge. It's a space elevator. I mean, fair, but it's still massive. Uh, uh. Okay, I'm going to build some platforms here so I don't fall to my death, as I've been often happy to do. I just barely did not have enough. All right, space elevator, sweet. I'm gonna go up in it, yeah. You should watch it get loaded up. It's pretty uh, It's pretty interesting. All right, I agree, it's already it's pretty interesting. Because if you see there's something in the sky. Holy frick, yeah, there, there is. Wow. 
Okay, then. I guess they're very, very happy with us. Holy crap. I'm trying to back up just to get a good angle on this. This is craziness. Is there a way to turn off the UI? This would Not be, that I'm aware of. This would be the perfect screenshot. Key bindings. There's not. That's unfortunate. Well, thanks. Uh, no. yeah, there we go. I right. unequip this stuff. Maybe see about getting. Decent screenshot, like. Uh, there we go. You can scale the UI. Well, that's true. But it's oh, it's a very sensitive bar. I'll let you know. I'm okay as long as I can. Wow, yeah, completely removed it. Holy crap, that is amazing. Well, not completely. It's like one percent. But that is perfect to be able to get a decent screenshot. I still have to back up. It's just so massive. I love this. It's sun in there too. That'd be fun. Go this way. We get jetpacks or something at some point. That would be so useful. It's possible. If we don't, we probably there's probably a mod for it. All right, now make the UI any smaller. Zero point zero. No, okay. You can only go to zero point two. So, compass and hot bar background opacity. Oh, I don't want them opaque. Um, <laughs> that's so tiny. I love that. Um, See if I can't steal some copper ingots. <laughs> I think I got a decent enough screenshot. There we go. Perfect. Pretty happy with that. We. Oh. Let's try not to block my death. That'd be nice. Oh, yeah, there's 100 copper ingots in this one. Uh, plenty of cap, 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 cap. Phase one. What is phase one? We still have to build the space elevator. We have to complete phase one of the space elevator. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that is awesome. Jump pads. Ooh, jump pads. Logistics Mark II, ooh, Mark II conveyor belts, stackable conveyor pole, ooh, ooh, makes me happy, ooh, rotors, we haven't made rotors yet.
Okay, this is this is getting cool and crazy, and I love it. And yeah, like I kind of I kind of want the six mark two. I don't know about you. Oh my gosh, we yeah, we do have a lot of <laughs> we do have a lot of iron plates. A little crazy. Uh, uh, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh wait, no, it doesn't change the objective, it just changes the milestone. Nice! Yay! Happy with that. Color cartridge. What the heck is that? Applying patterns to structures. Interesting. Don't know if I care. <coughs> Enforced iron plate, please. What am I missing for this? Do we have any concrete left? Mm -hmm. uh. Alrighty then. AI limiter? What is that? Don't know. Okay. You're the one researching that. That's what I was asking. All right. Yeah, just something shiny. This <laughs> fair. Oh gosh, I hate this. Uh, controls. Mm. So I changed, I toggled off hold to sprint. So now if I hold it, I stop sprinting. So if I tap it and then like continue to hold it, I'll, I won't sprint. And it's really annoying. What was I doing? Concrete, that's what I was. Tell you. Neither could I, friend, neither could I. We have not enough conflict. Bad. Why are you guys so slow? Oh, I see. This is 45 limestone per minute, but only produces 15 concrete per minute. And then this, you know, we can have a third one going. All right, get a third one going. This is inefficient. Stop. Oh my gosh, why is it doing that? Oh, that's why. Oh. Oops, I may have accidentally... Oopsie. Nothing. Nothing yet, but it's fine. Oh, stop whining. Wow. Good lag, good lag, good lag. That's Is there an instructor thingy, crafter? 
crafting bench up here. Oh my gosh, someone getting some just jitter lag and it's annoying. Craft bench. Oops. There we go. Wait till you see the gigantic spools of quick wire, man. <laughs> oh, goodness. Anyway, sorry, I'm trying to make the, the stuff more efficient. Oh, there it is. It wasn't loading properly, so it looked really, really blurry. What was? It's was like, mm, the quick wire. Uh, I think I just crashed the game. Nope, okay. Oh, I walked into a conveyor belt as I built it, and the game froze for a sec. I thought I crashed the game. I see. Okay, but I didn't. We're fine. Everything's fine here. How are you? Good. Good. I have an assembler automatically crafting reinforced iron plates. Nice. Auto magically. Auto magically. Just like magic. Oh my gosh, what are you doing over there? Hmm? Oh, just had an, another major lag spike. I opened up the ma'am. I think the game might not like people playing it for a long time or something. And so that was wonky. There we go. And we color all the things. Here we go. Oh, I just colored the uh, space elevator. Nice. That that works, I guess. Keep accidentally pressing C when I'm trying to press X. Anyway, this should produce concrete. I missed. Okay, I'm fine. Should also produce concrete. Oh, yeah. Ah. And produce concrete. Come Why here. no produce concrete? Limestone. Why limestone no go in? Power. <laughs> I literally almost jumped to my death. Take these. What's it's that? dangerous to go alone. What's that? Blade runners? What's that? Put them on. Uh, body? Yeah. Yep. What does he do? Zoom. Oh, just faster speed? Yep, and higher jump. Oh, that is nice, yeah. Alright, and you put power cable. Oh, wow. That jump is very powerful. Oh, no. Yeah, that's what I was just saying, because that's exactly what I just did. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I love this jump, though. This is amazing. I I am I am out of copper wire. Hmm, just no good. <gasps> what the hell is that? Was it? I'm so sorry, but like, what happened with me? I don't. What is I... going on? My body is being inflated. <laughs> okay. You're dead? Like, I... Maybe? Oh, hold on. Ah. Yeah, I died. Yeah, it sounded like you died. I mean, being inflated does not sound healthy. I Please. posted it in the Discord. Okay, I'll check in a second after I finally finished readjusting. There we go. Readjusting this bloody... Ah! Okay, I gotta get used to this jump. Holy crap. Uh, this thing. The, the thing I'm making more efficient. There we go, efficiency. All right, let me check this out. <laughs> what? 
What the crap, man? You, you, you became. That's uh, what I was thinking. Now, what's the boy from Willy Wonka? Augustus Gloop. Yes, you became Augustus Gloop. That was amazing. That, that is hilarious. Holy crap. How are we already at 35 minutes again? Oh my gosh. Yeah. Well, yeah, since that is the case, we should probably end the episode here. Thank you all for joining us. I've been Eli the T, joined by Exodiac, my good buddy and co-host. Hello. And often dying friend. Yep. 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 <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you've enjoyed any dimension of this episode. It really does help support the channel. And we do appreciate the support. I almost jumped to my death because I'm not used to this jump yet. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye.